Oh hi, do you want to learn 2D animation but don't know how to start as a beginner? Don't worry, today in this video I will show you how you can make a good quality animation video using these two apps in your smartphone. So I divided this video into three parts, things learn before starting animation, what you need for animation and how to animate. Number 1 Things learn before starting animation if you want to do 2D animation, then first of all you should know how to draw because 2D animation is a process of frame by frame drawings. That is why it is important to know how to draw. And in drawing, you need to practice shapes drawings like circles, squares and triangles because most of the objects and characters are made from the combination of different shapes and with their help, you can make anything very easily. After this, you need to learn about the 12 principles of animation which play an important role in making your animation more smooth and attractive to the audience. These 12 principles are stretch and squash, anticipation, secondary action, staging, timing, pose to pose and straight ahead, slow in and slow out, follow through and overlapping, arc, exaggeration, solid drawing, appeal. To understand them better, I will suggest you this video of Alan Baker's tutorials in which he had explained all this principle very well. Now let's move to the second point. What you need for animation. So to make 2D animation in your phone, you need graphic tablet or stylus or you can also use your finger but I would advise you to buy a cheap and good quality graphic tablet which support both PC and Android. I personally recommend you XP Pen Deco Mini 7 graphic tablet which is very good and also available in affordable price which support both PC and Android. Link is in the description. And you also need a mic for giving voiceover in your animation. I personally use Boya BIM1 mic for recording. The link is also in the description. And after this you have to download these two apps in your phone. Flip a clip in which you can draw your frame by frame animation and also you can add music and import images in Flip a clip. But for this you have to buy the premium subscription of Flip a clip. Ibis Paint in which you can create transparent PNG backgrounds for your animation which you can easily import in Flippa Clip. So now you have all the requirements, drawing skills and the basic knowledge of animation. So let's come to our last point, how to animate. Open Flippa Clip and select the format of the project. I always use 1920 by 1080 format and select frame rates according to your choice. I choose 24 because it is the standard rate. Name the project Bouncing Ball and start. First draw the basic structure. Create second layer for the object and name it ball. Now I am creating a bouncing ball. In bouncing ball always remember that whenever the ball is stretched or squashed the mass of the ball is always equal to the first layer ball. We cannot increase or decrease the mass of the ball. After that, let's color it. and hide the layer of the basic structure and create a new layer for shadow and decrease the opacity of the shadow layer to give it more natural look. After adding sounds, this is my result. Alright, time for the real thing. If you want to draw a character in flip a clip, always work in layers. In first layer, Draw the basic shapes for the character. Create a second layer for rough sketch. Now create a third layer for the outlines. Now for coloring. Just duplicate the outline layer and select the lower layer and use bucket fill option to fill the colors.
again create a new layer in the middle of outline layer and color layer and name them all. Let's name it shades. Use brush tool to draw shades. And again new layer for shadow. Decrease the opacity of this layer. And boom your character is ready. Similarly I made this animation using flipper clip and ibis paint. Now for background I am using ibis paint for background drawing and I am using these two brushes for entire drawing but you can use any brushes according to your comfort zone. Alright, after finishing the drawing, I download all the things in separately transparent PNG format. Now open flipper clip and import all the images in different layer. Place them according to the scene. Now after adding sounds and some effects, your proper animation looks like this. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope this video will help you to improve your animation. So yeah, this is it for today guys. Hope you enjoyed. Bye bye.